Hey, what's going on everybody? Bazanki here. Unless you live under a rock, you know that the presidential election is coming up in like two weeks. So today I want to put the political machine 2020 to the test and see if you can actually predict the 2020 election. Now before we get into the election, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you're new around here. If you like the video, like. Maybe leave a comment down below of your prediction, uh, whether or not it'll be accurate, and who's going to win the election. Also, stay tuned to the end for an exciting announcement. Alright, so as you can see, five weeks into the election, Trump endorses protecting our borders. And at seven week, Trump endorses America first. Week eight, Trump wants to build a wall. Now at week nine, Biden endorses reducing the wealth gap. Ten weeks in, Trump wants to deport all the illegal aliens. At twelve weeks, Biden wants to tax the rich. Sixteen weeks in, Joe Biden endorses universal health care. At week 18, Trump wants to bring the troops home. Twenty-one weeks, Trump wants our allies to pay their fair share. Also at twenty-one weeks, Biden wants to ban assault weapons. At 25 weeks, Biden wants to address climate change. In seven weeks of this election, the candidates pick their vice presidents. So for Donald Trump, it's Ted Cruz. And for Joe Biden, it is Pete Buttigieg. Also, Trump wants to pull out of NATO. Thirty-three weeks, Biden wants stricter gun control. One week now, forty-one weeks. Trump wants to drain the swamp. All right, so ten weeks before the election, you can see Joe Biden leads in the Electoral College two ninety-nine to Trump's two thirty-nine as well as in the popular vote 42.21 million to 36.22 million. Now at 46 week, Biden wants green jobs. Alright, here we are a week before the general election. You can see Biden is up 318 to 220 in the electoral college and is leading the popular vote as well. Joe spent quite a bit more money. Here we are, election night 2020. Who is going to be the next president of the United States? And with the state of California, Biden passes the 270 required to win the Electoral College, and he will be nominated in January as the next president of the United States. Was your prediction right? Is this prediction right? Find out in about two weeks. Thanks for watching.